Nobody likes long waits at the doctor's office, so here are a couple of tips to help shorten your wait time and the wait time of other people. Number one, be prepared. Number two, be upfront. Now being prepared is easy. It involves bringing your ID, your insurance card, and your vaccine record. You also need to know what medicines you're actually taking and you need to show up on time. If you can't be there on time, please call the office and let us know. And if you can't be there, give us a chance to give that appointment to someone else who's been waiting. Hello, Mrs. Crabapple. Mrs. Crabapple. What? Oh, hello, Dr. Whopper. How are you? Sorry I dozed through your riveting intro. Listen, sorry I'm an hour late. Traffic was bumper to bumper and I was on foot. And what else is happening? Oh, I forgot my ID too, but you know who I am. Anyway, what else? And so much going on. Oh, and I brought some things. I am prepared though, that's for you. Go ahead and have that. It's nice on ice. It's not even mine. Oh, and I'm on some medications, a couple of them. You might want to rifle through those. I know you have time. Peanut! Well, thank you. That's oh, very shit. thoughtful. Enjoy. I only suck the chocolates off of them. Oh! So enjoy. Being up front is also easy. It involves remembering that this appointment is about you. It's not about other people who aren't here or who don't have appointments. Also, you gotta make sure to let the front desk nurse know exactly why you're here. Doctors feel ambushed when you tell the nurse you're here for one reason, and then you turn around and tell the doctor a hundred other reasons. We simply don't have the time. Now, Mrs. Crabapple, yeah? I understand you're here to get a hangnail removed, is that right? No, I think, mm, I think I'm here to get a hangnail removed. Oh, excellent. Why don't you show it to me here so we can take care of it? Oh, that. sure. There it is. Yes. Oh, oh that's easy. We have just the thing to get rid of that here. So if you'll hang on, you got to hold tight because okay. if you get this wrong, it'll tear all the way to your elbow. Okay, I'll what? count to three. Are you ready? One, what? two. Oh, Betty White. Three. Son of a gun. That was a tough one. Okay. Well, Mrs. Grabapple, you did wonderfully. Oh, is that I'd it? I'd like to thank you for coming okay, today. Okay, well, thanks, Doc. And we're going to go ahead Do and you see moisturize? you on the way. We're going to have okay. you just step out. Yeah. I will, but oh. just one other thing. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. sorry. No time is money, but I... Son of a gun. I didn't know he was still alive. Anyway, I have one quick question. Quick. It's right here. It's real fast. It's a small... I just jotted it down on the little piece of paper here. There we go. And here it is right here. Okay. Oh, look, Seattle lost. That's not it. Listen, tell you what, I can, you know, I'm techno savvy. Why don't I just download it right over here to your, your little thingy here. There, there they are. Just a couple of questions, maybe three, four hundred. That last one really burns. I don't know if you have a salve or something like that. That's a lot of stuff there. Yeah, and that was just Monday. Well, I'll tell you something. We'd be happy to take care of those things, but we'll have to schedule for that. Let's go ahead and do that with the front desk today. Is that oh, okay with yes, you? Oh, yes, of course. I know oh, you're right. busy. Thank you so much. Thank you. I will just, oh, but one more thing. Yes. Just one more. It's kind of confidential. I want to talk about my son. He doesn't have an appointment. I didn't bring him with me, but my son believes he's a tree. A tree? Yes. Have you had him committed? Well, we would, but we really need the shade. 